Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use Uber app. So this is going to be a tutorial for beginners. But before we start, hurry up and check out our digital software just under this video. So let's get started. Now in this case, you might be new to Uber and you're wondering how do you actually start using it. Well, using the app itself is actually pretty easy. So first things first is we need to open up the Uber app. Now, by the way, if you don't have an account yet with Uber, we actually have a tutorial for that. So make sure to check our channel for that tutorial. But in this case, since we already created our account here, how do we actually start using Uber? Well, in this case, we'll be teaching you how to use rides here for Uber. Now, there are multiple ways to use our uh, Uber rides here. So you have by default the trip. We also have reserve, package, and car share. Now, in this case, each of the uh, options here do a specific thing. Now, for trip, uh, from the name itself, it just do trips, and meaning it's just a simple booking, and it will pick up, pick you up at as of this moment. So, if you choose reserve, you'll be able to schedule a ride on a specific time, and you'll be picked up for that time, and you'll be uh you'll be uh, sent to that specific location that you've chosen. Now, the package here is somewhat kind of unique because you have two options. So you have send package and receive package. Now, if you want to send this package to a specific person, like for example, across the city, you could choose to send a package option here. But if you want to receive a package from a specific person from a pickup point, you could choose to receive package option here. Now, you also have car share here. So if you click on it, you should be able to see it in the screen here. So this might take a while, but in this case, uh, car share from the name itself helps you uh, share your ride with specific people. Now, in this case, how do we use the trip and reserve here? So before we are able to book something, it is suggested first that you add a payment uh, method first. Now, in this case, at the bottom right of your screen, go ahead and click on account. And from here, choose payment. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to scroll down a bit here and choose the add payment method option. Now from here, choose the appropriate one here, maybe a credit card, PayPal, Google Pay, gift card, or Zip, you could go ahead and just add them. Now if you choose credit or debit card here, you'll need to enter a card details that includes the CVV as well as the expiration date and the card number itself. Now if you choose PayPal here, you need to log in into your PayPal account. Now, in this case, if you have a gift card that you want to use, you can actually add this into your account by clicking on the plus gift card or add gift card button. And you just need to enter the gift card, gift code. And from then on, click on save and you should be able to start using it on your rides. But in this case, again, how do we use it? Well, in this case, using it is actually pretty easy. So if you choose the trip option here, you'll be able to specify where you want to go or, or and spe specify where you want to be picked up. In this case, maybe, for example, we want to go to a specific location. Let's just say we want to screen street mall. We want to go there. Let's go and click on it. Now, from here, what we need to do is we need to uh, basically choose what type of trip that we want to do. So we have pool, Uber X, comfort, Uber XL, and also the popular ones here. So pool is from the name itself uh, is Uber pool, meaning you'll be able to pool with someone and they will be able to uh, have a ride with you. But in this case, uh, Uber pool is a lot cheaper than most of the options available here because again, you'll be sharing a ride with another person. Now, I also have the Uber X here, which in this case is uh, a bigger version of Uber. So uh, their car is a lot, a lot bigger than usual. So if you have a lot, a lot of uh, big people and your rides, uh, you could choose that. We also have Comfort here. So in this case, Comfort is going to be mid-sized cars with top-rated drivers. So again, you'll be matched with uh, drivers with uh, mid-sized cars that are top-rated. So the, usually those are four stars, five stars drivers. Now we also have Uber XL here. So in this case, these are affordable rides for groups of up to six people, meaning you'll be able to ride up to six people on this specific vehicle. Now there are going to be some requirements here. Like for example, if you're going to use Uber X here, you only have the option to have a ride for four people, meaning you will not be able to ride for six people. So the Uber, if they uh, if you inform them that there are going to be six people going, uh, going for the ride, but you just book Uber X, then they they have the capacity to deny you on the car itself because again you only serve for a four uh, person ride now if you are going to be a larger than four like six people make sure to choose uber xl here to avoid you being rejected by the driver itself 
Also have you have the popular here, which in this case you have comfort electric. So these are electric car or vehicles. Also have Uber pet. So if you have a pet coming with you, these are rides that accommodate your pet. Now, if you need special assistance, like for example, you need uh, assistance getting in the car, well, assist here is the way like, to go with you. Now, in this case, uh, what you need to do is you first need to choose your payment method here. So in this case, you could choose your uh, already added card or your gift card here if you have any balances in your Uber balances. Now, once you specify your payment, you could just go ahead and click on choose pool here and you'll be able to basically start, start booking it. And from then on, uh, Uber would actually search for a car or ride for you that would actually fit for the chosen service. Now, in this case, uh, they will notify you if uh, someone is ready to pick you up. And once they've actually picked you up, you just need to wait for them and they will message you that your ride is now ready. But yeah, so if you choose a serve here, you will be able to specify the specific time for your destiny, uh, for a specific location. So for example, our destination is going to be Queen Street Mall. And our location is maybe, I want to say it is going to be uh, in a specific location. Let's just choose a uh, location here. So maybe I want to say, I want to choose this one. Now, in this case, once you've chosen the location that you want to go to, you'll be able to uh, specify the time for it. So, yeah. So, this case, using it is actually pretty easy. But, yeah. So, those are the things that you need to do as a beginner. And uh, that's about it. So, if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.